Okay, uh, in this video, I'm going to show you where to change the code at in C Sharp uh, program files for the Connect 360 with the Connect Toolkit version 1.7. I'm using 1.7, which is the earliest one because I've got the early Connect 360 uh, device the 1414 14, whatever the 1.7 works better than the 1.8 for me go figure anyway uh, after you get your camera installed and uh, you verify that by looking up, up your device manager you need to have all four of these for your camera to work correctly okay so but you know this is after you've done all that and uh, you're ready to uh, start uh, programming yourself. Uh, you want to open up your toolkit. And I did this in C sharp. Um, here we are doing color basics. That's what you want to uh, pick. Do an install. Basically, you just you put the whole uh, folder somewhere, and I've already done it there. But I'm going to okay and get that out. So you've installed it, and all it is is this a you know a Visual Studio file um, with all the different ins and out. So you go ahead and you open this up. I'll go ahead and put it full screen. Yeah, I can see that really nice. Okay. Anywho, this is the screen. If it was blown up, you would see what it looked like for some reason uh, mine is not that big why is mine not that big I don't care it's not important what's important is that you highlight this box here in the middle which is your view box for your camera on your connect you click on it it automatically goes through the code saying here is the image image name image and here's the width and height of it yada yada and that's all it is in there now uh there's a certain code that you have to put in there and let me see if i can go ahead and get it up this one right here and i'll leave a link to this this is on stackoff uh, overflow.com um, but uh, it's a render transform uh, command so I'll show you how to put that in real quick it's really simple uh, so no problem there um, I'm gonna go to my desktop and go to my file and I'm going to pull up uh, mine. This is the one I've completed. So I click on that and this is the code that I put in. And basically it's from here to here that's all it is to rotate the image in that in your color basics and you can do this for your depth image also or anything you like uh, depending you know as long as it says image here um, some of the uh, viewers don't have that so it's a little tricky but uh, this is the code you put in I'm going to go ahead and do that one. 
go up here do this one okay this shows you the code side by side and I'm going to go ahead and raise that up raise that up okay so this is the original file that's what it says right there now I'll, I'll get all this in so that's it okay this is what you need it to say and all, all the code is is from here down to here that's it now we'll start over here we'll hit debug and as you can see I got a picture of my tank that I uh, painted when I went to pottery class with my daughter and I play World of Tanks so hey here it is uh, as you can see the writing on it is backwards because it's mirrored uh, like the Kinect originally has the image hey buddy um, so I don't believe I can do debug on this one because both connects are, are running at the same time yeah 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 so that ain't gonna work gotta close this one first but anyway you see where the image is all right so I'll close this window stop debugging this I go over here this is the one with the change program here that's the code that I put in very important very important okay uh, this little slash mark right here take it out gotta take it out if you don't won't work will not work sucks spend hours trying to figure out what's going on and I just got rid of that and it worked so hey anyway uh, after you put that code in voila homemade damn it hey buddy so it works it was really simple to do uh, the next video I will put in will be the connect Explorer how to change those around and that was a little bit more difficult but hey it works and now when I go paranormal investigating and I use my connect and I'm looking at skeletons it'll be on the right side of the room uh, so my I'll look at my lidar it doesn't get confusing for me anyway uh, there you go you don't have to give it a thumbs up don't have to give me anything because I'm not a YouTuber you can like it you can hate it I don't care leave a comment if you want you know but uh, I wanted to get this out there because I didn't see anybody else doing it so thanks